What's up, everybody? It's your boy JD back again with another video. And y'all know what time it is. You see the title. You know what's about to take place. Jujuku no Rakunin chapter review, chapter 18 and 19. And my God, my God. <sighs> the pain. So what's up everybody like i said y'all already know what it is but before we get into the video make sure to like share and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already roll to 1000 subs that's what we're on we're almost there everyone also for everyone who's already subscribed and supported through the patreon hey i appreciate you y'all y'all just don't know man i wish i could let y'all know how much but it really just don't know how much it means to um me and g for the, all the support you guys give but like I said, if you want to take your support even further, Patreon link is in the description below. Giveaway coming soon. Exclusive content is over there that's not on the channel. So if you want to check that out, definitely go there. But now let's get into the review. So, yeah, man. Um, chapter eight, chapter 18 titled Me Toy. Now, recall Me Toy, it wasn't that bad um compared to chapter 19. But chapter 18 was really just, it was more like a setup for what's to come. And if you didn't know what was coming, man, you was in for a rude awakening. So, as we know, Yurma got your boy and was like, yo, round two is about to start. So, after, <laughs> Lord Jesus, just remember, after the little torture device that Yurma shoved up um, a certain area that was that's behind a person, um, twitched it, cut it wide open, blood and all that stuff everywhere, um, what you call it realized that he was in the same spot where his girlfriend, aka girlfriend, Karen, was being held. So he's like, yo, this is the place where me and Karen, you know, why you know kept Karen hidden. Why are we here and where is she? And Yurma, bro, Yurma is dirty, fam. He was like, What's the rush? You gonna see her? Don't worry about it. And then he starts spilling out like this man did his research, bro. Like he knew when they met um how they met everything i'm like you're a where did you first of all where did you get this information that's what i want to know like i i get that you did your research i got it i understand that but you you have mad research like i don't even know how you got all this information but and then comes through the door as you're must giving this man all the information on like what's going on what's been going down how he met Karen and all this stuff. Karen walks through the door. And bro, when Karen walks through the door, she you can tell, first of all, you can tell she's broken. You can tell she's broken. Like, it it was crazy. Like, her eyes, like, it was no life in her eyes. Hair is all over the place. And they made her look so psychotic and crazy. That it was only perfect for this type of series. The way she looks and the way she's acting. And the first words that come out of her mouth. Did you really love me? I said, oh my God. Oh my God. This ain't about to be good. This is not about to be good. And she starts telling him how, how he ruined her life. And how she can't even go back to her family. She can't go back to school. And all of this other stuff. And then she pulls from behind her back. The pair of anguish. Now if, you, now, if you don't know what the Pier of Anguish is, that's the same little device that Yurima used the previous chapter to stick up the um, anal part. <laughs> and this one is a lot smaller. So, guess where this one is going? And that's when chapter 19 broke. Whew! I don't even know how I was able to read chapter 19. That's how bad it was, bro chapter 19 look all, chapter 19 is titled inside so that should tell you everything you need to know about what the hell is about to take place inside of something so she's like look i'm going to put this inside of you and he's like what do you mean inside like he didn't understand <laughs> he did not understand what was about to happen to him so she was like look I'm going to ask you some questions. 
she she sticks it inside of him, throws him on the ground, and like, yo, I'm about to ask you some questions. And he like, please pull it out. Please don't do this. Don't do it. Because you know, you seen what happened with the other one. So this one in this other area, and if you don't know what other area, look, I am not about to explain it. It should be self-explanatory. If one was in the back, the other one is going somewhere else. But that's all I'm going to say about that. But man, oh man, oh man. So she starts asking him questions like, yo, why did you go out with me? Um, what did I look like to you? What did I mean to you? And why would you lock me in here? And every question that he answered, if he didn't answer truthfully, she was turning the, she was turning it, boy. She was turning it to open it up. So er, and even if he did answer truthfully, she still turned it. And I was like, bro, the pain. Like, as a guy, come on, man. As a guy, you read this chapter. It, it it had to be hard for you to read it because it took me like 20 minutes to read this chapter, bro. I, because I was just so invested and like immersed into what was going on in this chapter. I felt I felt like it was me in the chair. I'm like, goodness gracious, like, can I survive this? <laughs> but man, bro. So then she asked him the fatal final, final question. Did you ever at any point really love him? this man I don't know what got over him I guess he was like yo YOLO I'm I'm about to die anyway I'm I'm just about to take it all out I'm about to take it to the head bro this man said there's no way I loved you you meat toy that sealed the fucking deal because after that she twisted it wide open blood splatter everywhere needless to say he died instantly and the worst part about it, but the worst part about it, Karen took her own life afterwards. And I was like, man. And Yurima was like, what the hell just happened? Like, I'm pretty sure Yurima had it to where he knew Karen was going to torture her. But I'm pretty sure he didn't think that Karen was going to kill herself as well. So, man, crazy chapter. Crazy, crazy chapter, bro. Um, what a way to go. What a way to go. Like I said, we only got we only got three bullets left. We're on chapter 19. I have no idea how long this chapter is gonna go. I mean not chapter, this series is gonna go, but man, it's a it's a wild ride to say the least. It's it's crazy, bro. It's crazy to say the least. But that's pretty much it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. But man, I it ain't really much to say about this chapter. <laughs> it ain't really much about this review, just on how painful, gory, and crazy everything was, man. But, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, like I said, if you haven't read this um, and you're interested, go at your own risk. <laughs> That's all I'm going to tell you. Just read at your own risk. But it's an amazing series nonetheless. But like I said, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Roll to 1,000 subs is what we're on. Appreciate everybody for rocking out with your boy so far. Also, if you want to take your support even further, Patreon link is in the description. If you want to keep up with me, Discord link is also in the description. You can follow me on Twitter at the Otaku Fix. And definitely let me know what you think about chapter 18 and 19 in the comment section below. Until next time, I'm JD. I'm out. Peace, y'all.